hope this was a good idea. So what is through this door? A death trap? A mad scientist with a pretty girl and a talking robot? An alien cafeteria? Why am I just standing here? After all, as Brink found out, the worst thing that can happen is you can take one wrong step and you're dead. So much for the cafeteria idea. Boston, are you there? They use geometric shapes as a kind of combination for the locks. Boston, you won't believe where I am. I'm in a place filled with alien technology, the most fantastic things I've ever seen. And the machines are working. What are they doing? I don't know yet. I mean, they're really alien. Like nothing I've seen before. Don't go too fast, Maggie. I'll be careful, Boston. But it's not like we have time to use correct scientific procedures to test these things. Where are you? How can I get to you? I wish I knew. It's a sure thing you can't get here the way I did. I slid through a low tunnel in the rock, and then it kind of got filled with debris when the roof collapsed. You could have been killed. Gee, I guess this isn't safe. But if we'd been together, whoever went through the crack second would definitely have been killed. Keep that in mind when you're thinking about coming to save me. I handled it just fine. Yeah, I guess you did. We're both doing okay, Boston. We'll find a way to connect up with each other when it matters. Uh, Maggie? Good work. Thanks, Boston. Now I know what my pet hamster felt like. But I need some help to pry this door open. Plenty of water here. If it's drinkable, then we won't die right away. We'll have plenty of time to starve to death. <laughs> if Maggie were here, I'd tell her not to take a chance on swimming in the same water with a large eel that may or may not think of her as dinner. So maybe I'll take my own advice and stay on dry land.
another ghost. The last one pointed the way down into the Nexus. Of course, that's how Brink died. Bunch of displays set into the walls. Inscriptions here and there. I'd say it looks like some kind of museum. Strange glowing crystals. Symbols written on a plate. Looks like an alphabet. Could this be some sort of burial chamber? Another one of these engravings on a stick. Boston! Maggie, I found you! I wasn't aware that I was missing. You know what I mean. I found a way to get where you are. Through the museum, back that way. That's nice, Boston. If that's the museum, then I guess this is the library. I found out how to open doors back in the Nexus. There's a tram that leads out here. Look, Boston, I think it's great you're finding things out, but I'm trying to concentrate here. I feel like I'm so close to making sense of some of this stuff, and I just want to stay here and keep working. All right? Sure, of course. I just... Anyway, I know where to find you, and you know how to get out of here if you want to. Thanks. Yes. When I learn something, I'll call you on the box, okay? All right. All right, yes. I, I won't bug you anymore right now. Robbins. As irritating as he was sometimes, I really miss having Brink around. There's nothing you could have done. Let it go.
I'm sorry Brink is dead. But I don't think it's right for you to blame me for it. I don't blame you. It's not safe for us to be separated. It's not safe for us to be together, either. In fact, Boston, it's just plain not safe. I'm sorry that I can't protect against every possible accident. But that doesn't mean it isn't better for us to stay together. Would you stop taking this personally, Boston? I'm doing my best to decipher the inscriptions that are all over the place here. Would you be any good at that? No. So please, go do what you're good at, and I'll stay where I am and do what I can do best. Brink's death scared me too, Maggie. Well, it didn't scare me. I've seen people die before Boston. I've covered terrorism, I've covered executions, I've covered wars. So what you're saying is, this is just another assignment for you? Coming on the space shuttle to divert the course of Attila, that was just another assignment. Nobody ever asked me if I wanted to go to an alien world from which there might be no return. Nobody knew. You expected something alien, Boston, and you didn't tell me. What if you had known? Known everything? Coming here, being marooned, Brink dead. Oh, shut up, Boston. You would have come anyway, wouldn't you? Don't you have something useful to do? Brink's still dead. Thanks for the status report. How are you doing with your data retrieval? I'm retrieving. I'm just not understanding. But you're pretty sure it's their language. I don't know. Just like the museum you found, I think this library was meant to be used by lots of different species. I think this language may have been especially designed to be easy to translate. If it's easy, why is it taking so long? It's easy compared to translating a genuinely alien language that you've never heard spoken aloud. Give me a break, Boston. I think I've got a handle on a couple of the symbols, but I have to test it out and see if it makes sense. I'm thinking that maybe we should consider teaming up again. Why? I think the answer to getting home is here in these displays. You go out and explore like you have been, and I'll work at getting us home. When I figure it out, I'll take you with me. No charge. I found this in the museum. Can you read it? It's not the same set of symbols I'm finding in the database here. I don't think it's designed for strangers to be able to read it. I wish you could read this inscription. I keep thinking that it really matters. Give me a chance to get a handle on their language first. I'll give your inscriptions a try when I can. Do you think it's possible to raise the dead? Spiritually, yes. I've witnessed many ceremonies. Physically rejuvenate, I'm not sure. Why? Oh, probably nothing. You won't believe what I found, Maggie. I just turned on something that looks like a bridge made out of light. A bridge made from light? Where does it go? I don't know yet. I can't quite bring myself to step foot on it. I understand. Maggie, I found a plate like the ones in the asteroid that triggered our journey here. For all we know, any plates we find might send us on a voyage to the opposite edge of the galaxy. Tell you what, I'll keep looking for more of them and you decipher that language so we can read the directions. Great. You get to look for metal things lying around on the ground while I have to decode a completely alien language without any information about how they think or what they might be writing about. Yeah, that's a fair division of labor. Still looking for more of these plates, Maggie. While you're at it, see if you can find a big juicy steak. Or, I'm not fussy, a nice salad or even a couple of grapes. There's no doubt about it, Maggie. 
These ghosts are trying to guide us. Well, I wish one of them would come here and help me translate these inscriptions. Thanks. Sure packs a punch. 